so long, Ernie. This place is jam-packed full of goats. Thank God, Ernie. <laughs> <laughs> no, I saw them here. I even smell them. Oh, <laughs> again. Oh. Oh, again. Come here. little goat girl. Not so little. He said she was a child. Look at that outfit. Hey, Pete, come out here. A little young, but cute. No wonder Pete was in no hurry to come home. Hey. Tammy. 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 I be so fair, Pete. Walked all day. Tammy. Your grandfather. Taken away. Told me you said I should come. What in the world, Peter? The child from the river? Yes, Mother, it's Tammy. Where shall I put her? Her grandfather? He's dead, I think. Oh, poor dear. Put her in Aunt Rennie's studio. Well, there's one anyway. I told you I smelled them. Maud Japonicus. up an old southern custom. This is the Johnsonist bed, Pete. It's as good as a joggling board. Oh, what's a joggling board? Well, I ain't never seen one, but I heard tell it's like a bench, only you can jounce on it. A little cream and lots of sugar. Mm -hmm. A juggling board, huh? Now, what would anyone use it for? The cotton. Now, Tammy, well, you shouldn't go around saying things like that. Tom might think you're trying to put ideas into his head. You can use it to joggle a baby to sleep on, too. Now, you can, huh? Yeah. Thank you. Well, I've got to go down now and see how my garden's growing. Your garden? A little bit of experimental farming. See, I got a crazy notion. Maybe I can make this old place pay for itself. Ain't nothing crazy about farming. Well, it depends. If my Brentwood pride number six works out, I'll be with you. If not... What's a Brentwood pride number six? Oh, well, that's something I've been working on for the past couple of years. It's... It's the biggest, plumpest, 
reddest early ripening tomato in the whole state. They ought to run at least 30,000 pounds to an acre. Is that a lot? Is it? Well, you wait till you see them. Now, meanwhile, that coffee will have to hold you. No breakfast today. The cook's temperamental. Cook? Yes, a sire. You mean there's a woman who comes and cooks? When she's in the mood. But your mother's here, and Miss Remy. Oh, well, they haven't touched the stoves. Say, didn't you have an old wood burner on the L&B? Tammy, would you mind terribly? Oh, no. I... I'd be pleasured. Save from starvation. Here, you get out of that, uh, that relic of Aunt Rennie's, and I'll get the fire started. You don't think he is among angels? Not where he's gone. Oh, Nels, Beth, I forgot the toast. Not a sign of proper grief. Your Tammy. Morning, Alice Rennie. Peter's on. Morning, ma'am. Be quiet, Picasso. Do you like Carol? Sure do. I have seven. I have to keep him hidden while Enoch, you know, that's Mrs. Brand, is here. She hates them. She does. Mm -hmm. Matt, but I love to eat. Hate cooking. Never pass a kitchen stove that I don't kick it. Oh. One more piece, please, for Castle adores it. Yeah. Thank you. Um, uh, I sleep in the room next to the studio. That's nice. I heard a man's voice in there early this morning. It was Pete. He came in to make me welcome. In your bedroom? Yes. It's an old Southern custom. Mm -hmm. 